So I wanted to make a video today real fast and show the difference in what I've started with and lawn care industry being full time to what I'm actually currently running now. So I started literally with this push mower right here. Um, yeah, literally that thing. I had a different weed eater than this one. My other one was a steel FS45. It's a it's curve shaft. It was a it was a cheap one for sure. Uh, but then that one got stolen, and so a friend of mine actually gave me this one. When this one wasn't bad, but over time it's just needed something better. And then I ended up buying this uh, leaf blower here. It's a uh, Lowe's brand, it's like eighty five bucks. Nothing crazy, nothing like that. Um, so that's literally what I started with. I just threw all this in the back of my truck every day, and went and mowed yards from whenever I got up in the morning to whenever I'd finally stop and to uh, end up getting upper to this. So that's my truck. I've had that the whole time. But um, the trailer was one of my next investments is I ended up buying a, a old tractor mower. It was a power craft. And I drove the wheels off that thing for a while, saved a bunch of money up and I bought a, a zero turn. So, but whenever I was saving much money up, I ended up actually buying this trailer first. And this was a Lowe's trailer. I bought it for like 688 bucks or something like that. So then I bought that, and then my next investment was the mower. And the mower actually ended up buying at a local shop, and it was uh, 650 bucks. It's the uh, Hustler Fast Track, the 44-inch deck. Um, when I first bought it, it gave me a lot of issues and stuff like that because it was a used mower and everything. But uh, it ended up actually being a decent mower so far. I've taken things off of it and replaced a bunch of parts on it, and I've dumped a ton of money into it. But it's now it's running pretty good. Um, so what was next uh so i got the mower and then oh i got this uh this weed eater right here this is the uh fs91 by steel um killer weed eater lots and lots of power it made a world night and day difference uh later on i actually ended up getting this uh what is it, the fs uh 70 rc i believe yeah rc um, so I ended up getting that. Uh, I took the guards off both of my tremors because it's just so much easier to do anything with. But uh, and so on. My next investment I ended up purchasing was this uh, leaf blower. It's a backpack blower here. It's the Red Max 8500. This thing, stupid awesome. I love this thing. Um, would I go back to handheld? Absolutely not. That thing is amazing. Um, so what do I care currently? How like how do I set up my truck and trailer? So my blower goes in the back of the truck for now. I don't have a, a rack for it yet but that's something i need to buy next so that goes in the bed of my truck um this milk crate here it's got my uh mixed gas for the, the trimmers and the blower and then i got my string like big spool and then down there i've got a a jug of oil for my mower because my, my mower does have a slight oil leak so then i carry a two gallon gas jug for my mower my mower also has dual tanks on it though and each of them is like a four gallon tank so it holds quite a bit I, in one day i've never ran completely out but it does, uh, it does do lots of good stuff for me. <clears throat> so I got a uh, spare tire for my trailer because it sucks having single axle and have a blowout. So I got that at Lowe's too. That was like another 70, 80 bucks or something like that. The uh, tire, spare tire rack was like 30 bucks. Not a big deal at all. Um, yeah. Oh, I, the, I also got a, a sign on my trailer. Um, that is my phone number. Guys, don't call me unless you like, need your yard mode and you're in like, my area. But uh, got that made, that was less than a hundred bucks. Uh, I'm skipping up here to the front of my truck now. Oh, on the roof, I got a little mini light bar. It's, it's uh, orange and I got that just for uh, traffic and stuff like that, because some cars are assholes. Uh, magnetic deals on the side of my truck. This uh, was, was it 40 bucks, 80 bucks? No, they're, I, I want to say it was less, it was like 80 bucks or less. And then here on this front of my truck, I got this done. And that cost me 20 bucks to get both sides done. And that was stupid easy all that but uh yeah that's literally what my lawn care setup looks like after being in business for not even a full year so it's pretty easy to save money save money and save money um the strike kit though i have i built for my mower it's literally uh a mud flat from the semi so what i did i took it and i bolted it up in here to the frame and it just drags around and just folds the grass over so that is one easy way to do it there was a uh really bar in the back of this thing but i took it off but uh yeah so after being in business for one whole year this is the my setup i'm currently running with uh hoping to next year have a, a bigger setup and i'm having better equipment so uh yeah toodles guys